Okay, the next part of the project will be attaching our metal rod that we made onto our airplane. And so we have to figure out where to place this onto the bottom of the airplane. I use a very unscientific method as eyeballing and seeing about where the airplane's level. So I've got a nail here and I'm going to just move the airplane until it just stays where I want it to stay. So that's how the airplane's going to stay and how it's going to be on the post. And I want to have it pretty much balanced so that one side is not heavier than the other. So what I'll do now, I'll take my pen Okay, I've got my pen, and I'll just come straight down, and I'm going to put a little mark. So right there is where I'm going to put my steel rod. So I'll show you how I do that. All right, we're back at the welding table again, and we're going to attach this steel rod to the airplane. So what I've done... To get this rod in the center, I have a piece of plate and that brings the airplane up one half the diameter of this rod. And right there is where the airplane should be. I'll get my ground clamp onto it. Now what I do, I got the bottom of this other plate uh, at a right angle to this rod and I'm going to look and see and determine exactly how I want that airplane to look when it's on the weather vane. Right there looks pretty good so we'll weld him in place right there, put a weld there, turn it over, put another weld on it. I'm going to use, I'll go about 115 amps on the welder. I want to get, get my spectacles on so I can see. And we'll put them together. Hope my head's not in the way, uh, but you get the gist of what I'm going to do. All right, let's see how it works. Well, that appears to be in the middle. What do you think? Now what I like to do, I like to go ahead and take a look at what the actual airplane looks like in the weather vane before I get too aggressive on the welding, just in case I've got to cut it apart. As you can guess, I've had to cut it apart before. I don't have the bearing in yet, but I can get an idea. I'm just centering this in here what you look like. And I like that. I, I think that will look good. Got this fairly level to the ground, so in a flight attitude, that's what it will look like. Every airplane's a little bit different. You just have to play around and see what you like. What looks good to you? What look, looks good to me might not look good to uh, you, so just whatever your personal preference is. Let's see. So let's go this way. 
and these don't have to be big huge welds there's not a lot of force on here and uh, just these small wells that I'm putting on like this seem to work fine I've, I've never had one fall off and we've had some pretty big winds here lately Well, that well, it's terrible. No wonder I didn't have my glasses on. I don't know why I couldn't see what I was doing. Now ah, that's better. Now I can see. Yeah, what a difference. When you can see your work makes all the difference in the world. Okay, got him welded up. And next thing, we'll go ahead and put the bearings in.